Welcome to another episode of Doco's Corner. We've got an update today and a package opening. I think we'll start with the package. It's from Rose Creek. Okay, let's see. I think I know what it is, but I don't know. Later, uh, as you, if you see my um, collection, I do have 28 weeks later, so I thought it was best to get this one too. Okay, so about a new game. I bought the Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion Fifth Anniversary Edition. Uh, I did have the regular edition with the original game and Knights of Mine, but this one also includes Shivering Isles, and I haven't played that one, so that would be fun. Maybe I'll finish this... Yeah, I'll probably finish this before uh, Skyrim arrives. I, I have pre-booked this, so... Uh, the 5th anniversary edition also includes Making of Oblivion, a behind-the-scenes documentary on the making of Oblivion, Oblivion game map and all the expansions. So I got work to do, and we've got ah uh, some more movies. Um, first we got uh, let's see here, Legends of the Guardians. We got this is for Emma. Remember Me with uh, Robert Pattinson from uh, Twilight. We got Jackass 3, Extended Cut. We got Newt Nuns with Big Guns. Uh, this is another new Grindhouse movie. Like uh, in my previous update, I did the Nazi Zombies, and I think that also is a Grindhouse. Um, I think it's from the same. Company, as you can see, the the box is really the same. The whole paper thing going on. Then we've got a Japanese vampire movie called Thirst, from the director of Old Boy, which I also have. It's really good. We've got Woody Harrelson's Defendor. I think it's like a kick-ass type of movie. We got Messenger 2, The Scarecrow. Uh, it's a Danish movie. Oh. We've got Matt Damon's Green Zone. It's, I think it's a war movie with Matt Damon. Stanton Hill. Chainsaw Massacre meets Saw. I haven't seen this one, I haven't heard about it, but it looks cool, so I bought it. And lastly, Repo Men. This movie actually got a lot of complaints because it's way too much like another movie called Repo the Musical. I have seen Repo the Musical, I haven't seen this one. And Repo the Musical, I really like. This got some really good music, and uh, it stars. Um, the guy who plays Giles in uh, Buffy the Vampire, and uh, he really can't sing. He, yeah, really cool. I think I'll need to find that one too. I think it needs to be in the collection. Uh, that's it for now. Nothing else. No. Um, the the main thing I've got like so many movies now is because my local video store. Is selling uh, used uh, videos. I don't. I don't mind if they're used, as long as they got a nice cover and the DVDs hold. So I don't give a shit. But they sell these for what is it? Uh, Ten movies for like thirteen bucks. In Swedish, that is uh, ten movies for uh, one hundred uh, Swedish kroners. So I've bought. 30 movies the last couple of two days for 
but he was that in dollars, like $35 something, $40 something. So, yeah, that's quite a bargain. Uh, old, or new. Uh, I've got a couple more packages coming. Hopefully they'll turn up about next week. So, 